hello hello kids and today we're gonna do a little pick a card on you know just some loving messages from your angels okay so one two and three okay so i want you to pick a card that you're drawn to okay i want you to pick a card that you feel that would resonate with you one one a two and a three okay so pick one that you're drawn to all right so you could pause it right here but without further ado i'm gonna get started okay so let's get started on pound number one all right sweetie so pound number one don't stop whatever you're doing you're doing such a wonderful job okay okay let go okay that's what you're doing is you're letting go you're letting go of things that are no longer good for you wonderful so something's going okay so trust okay so something's essential for you okay you have trust is essential for you right now okay trusting in the divine trusting in your higher self see that card trusting in the higher self of you okay so you have to trust you, pound number one. Okay? So, what you have to do, your message, your angels want to say is, is that you're doing a wonderful job and there's nothing that you need to change, okay? So just keep doing you and whatever you're doing, it's working, okay? Okay. Pound number two. Okay. So, I see the goddess Isis, okay, within this image, okay? And so when I see Isis, you see love. You see true love, okay? So Isis is the one that manifests and is the mother. So I'm seeing that there's going to be Hmm. Tell me, spirit, more about this, angels. Tell me more about this connection. Okay, so there's going to be a twin flame union coming for you, okay? This is going to be union with your divine counterpart, okay? This is what's coming in for you is what your angels want to tell you, okay? You have to keep healing from your childhood, though. There are some things... Some things you got to keep letting go of these people from the past, okay, that have hurt you. You have to keep moving on, okay, sweetie? Okay, yeah, queen of swords, okay? So a motherly figure, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm picking up mother. Mother is like a, a theme here, okay? Maybe you could have a conversation. I don't know, maybe this person, they carry motherly energy. But all I'm saying is you are attracting a person that is a motherly figure, okay? And this person has very wonderful energy, okay? So, your angels want to remind you to stand your guard. You have to continue to know your worth, okay? Because you see with the magician card, people are trying to play with your mind. They're trying to send you negative energy, okay? They're trying to send you, see this man with the evil eye? They're trying to stop you from manifesting whatever it is that you desire they're trying to stop you okay somebody is is trying to get in the way of this union okay so okay what do we need to do so pile number two you are going to have the love of your life to be it's going to manifest okay and all you have to do is you have to have a boundary king of wands okay you have to have your divine masculine tapped in. And this is meant for you, pound number two. This love life is meant for you, okay? This person, this lover that's coming in, they are meant to be with you. This is a forever. This is a twin flame. This is a strong connection. So what else does spirit want to say? You're ready, okay? So you are ready for this journey ahead, okay? So... Um, and also this person that's coming in, they're ready for you too, honey. That's why they're coming in. So pound number two, what's coming in? A lover's coming in, okay? 
that's what your angels want to tell you. So let's move on to pile number three. Okay. So there's going to be big happy changes coming for you, pile number two. And the card came in to verify. Just an extra confirmation. Look, no need to worry. Yep. So I feel like sometimes you may worry. You get a little too anxious sometimes, okay? Maybe you need to go... Um, you should go get a massage or something. If it's not a massage, maybe you should maybe go to take a hot bath, okay? That's what Spirit is saying. So this is what you should do. Is It's not necessarily a cleansing ritual, but it will help you with um, clearing your mind. I feel like you should use an oil, okay? It's um, lavender, okay? Um, you should try to shop and like maybe go to the store. And find lavender okay and you should you could even get it in a lotion whatever it is I feel like you need to start having lavender around you okay because lavender really helps with people that struggle with anxiety and all these other things okay um also tea tree oil really helps too okay so pound number three um you need to have something to relax you okay so maybe you need to take either a vacation take time off or there needs to be something with you taking care of yourself okay so like maybe you should take yourself to like um i don't know get in a hot tub and relax okay pound number three you need to be in a place where you are relaxed and also away from people okay so pound number three your angels want to tell you that you need to get like a massage or something you need to or even if it's not that you need to get in a hot tub, okay? Or take a hot bath, okay? And you need to take multiple of them, okay? Because this is, you need to be basically do something that helps relax your body because you're releasing so much trauma, so much things, pound number three, that you need to relax your body, okay? Working now, it does a thing too, but you need to take something, you need to do something for your body, pound number three. So maybe taking a nice bath, every other week and you know putting some oils that really does help okay but yes pile number three your angels they're recommending you maybe get into some um like aromatherapy okay also into i have something called it's like a diffuser you put some uh, little oils in it and you could just you let it um go out in the air during the day okay it's nice or even when you sleep you should get yourself a diffuser pile number three so what I'm thinking here, pile number three, is that you just need to relax, honey. Um, but you you are in the process of welcoming a new beginning. And the universe says to not worry. But yes, honey, what I recommend you to do is to just relax, okay? Your angels are telling you, take a hot bath, okay? Um, take a hot bath, I don't know, take a vacation. You need to do something, pile number three, because, you know... You're just releasing so much and, you know, maybe take some acupuncture. You might just do something, okay? Um, um, your angel said, do something that helps relax the body, okay? And not help uh, stress it out. So, like, working out, no, 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 don't do that, okay? So, what your angels are telling you is don't worry, okay? But also, take it exactly what the angel said is have some essential oils, take a bath, and just start to relax, okay? So your angels are basically telling you to, you need to relax, do something to relax, hot tub, whatever it is that you need to do, because you're just currently healing and all that other stuff, okay, baby? But other than that, you have nothing to worry about. All the angels are telling you to say, please take a hot bath or something. <laughs> and that's what I have for you, dear.